Hi Capricorn, welcome to Straight from the Divine Tarot. I'm doing your read for the third week of May 2022. Of course, it's timeless. It's for whenever you feel drawn towards this uh, video. Um, just to quickly go through the spiel, spiel uh, for the new subs uh, that are out there that are not, not familiar in how I do things. And before I start anything, it is Mercury retrograde. I'm tripping over my words. I'm making errors. I apologize in advance. I'm very, very sorry. So here we go. I don't use the genders. I don't use the signs because we embody those energies throughout our lifetimes. Depending on the situation, it doesn't matter whether those signs are in our charts or not. Uh, case in point, you could be a nurse sign wanting to speak your truth and set some boundaries with people. The card that's going to re represent you is going to be the Queen of Swords in the upright. Whether you're male or female, it doesn't matter. It's just energy. So if I use the pronouns he or she, it's only because it's on the cards and it's helping to keep it, keep it straight in my head. So take what applies, toss the rest, and don't try to make it fit. It is a general read, so keep bear that in mind. You're going to have to use your uh, higher wisdom and your... Uh, your discernment. Um, yeah, so if this is your read, you're going to know who's whom immediately, without a doubt, okay? Um, it's just the way I do things. So let's, uh, if you like the videos, uh, please like, share, and subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you know when I upload. I think I've got it all out there. <laughs> so here we go. For the sign of Capricorn, for uh, third week of May 2022, Spirit Guides, Guardian Angels, Ancestors of the White Light. How would you like to start this read for the sign of Capricorn, please? Oh, thank you. The Arrow Master, hitting the mark, intention, detachment. Card number 10. So 10 in tarot is the Wheel of Fortune. Ooh, so whatever is going on here, it's meant to propel you where you need to go, move you forward, okay? It's destiny, it's fate. Spirit guides, guardian angels, ancestors of the white light. What are your messages for the sign of Capricorn? The third week of May, 2022, please. You're the last three signs that I'm doing. I just uh, did the reads and then I had to skip out to the store and I went out and now I'm back to do with you and the Aquarius and Pisces now. So it'll be done for the third week of May. I won't have to worry about it. <laughs> it hangs over my head, you know. I feel like, oh, I got to get this done. I got to get this done. I'm just one of those people. I just I don't rest until it's done. So, okay, what do we have for... That might have bearing to do, something to do with you. Um, nothing's accident, by the way. Whatever a reader says or happens during a read, it's never by accident. It usually, usually has something to do with what's going on in the read. Are we ready, Spirit? They're a little slow. Are we ready? I heard no. Okay. Okay. Ready? Yes. Okay. <laughs> Sorry it took so long. Capricorn. All right. Um, oh, we have a new offer here. We have an offer coming in, maybe a small offer, a new beginning. Um, you could be accumulating some information. Uh, Page of Pentacles in the upright. Um, so you, could, you could be listening to tarot reads. I could be it too. Uh, accumulating information for work, a new beginning in work. You're a master of your craft. Eight of Pentacles in the upright. <clears throat> You're working on yourself. Maybe you have an opportunity to work on yourself. Eight of Pentacles, put some effort in, you know. It's hard work, but you're getting it done. You're a master. Um, yeah, this is working hard in order to bring about success. Why is the Page of Pentacles here for the sign of Capricorn? There's a new beginning. That was weird. The truth is out. There's a new beginning. There's a new a little offer coming in. Something slow, steady. Um, some lights been shed upon us. Okay, that that's that makes better sense. Accumulating information, the truth is out. To, to, yeah, there's clarity here. There's awareness. Judgment in the upright. In order to make a judgment call, in order to make a decision, uh, somebody may, may want to come back, uh, get a second chance, whether it's relationship, friendship, work. There's a small offer here, a new beginning. We'll see where this goes. It's good news, though, though that was eight of wands in the upright. So that typically implies good news. Why is moon in the reverse with sign of Capricorn, please? Third week of, yeah. Ooh, it's going to bring you into some stability, some security, some su success here. Finding out. There's an offer. It's going to be successful. Whatever this is, it's going to... Mmm accumulating about somebody's success the truth about somebody's success about their stability 
see where this goes. Ooh. Bottom of the deck. Uh-oh, star in reverse. Could be illness. Getting some help here. Getting somebody's success. Somebody's losing hope. They want a new beginning. And some truths that come out about their stability, their successfulness. Maybe they're losing hope. They can't compete. Yeah, they have no money. So somebody wants a second chance with you, possibly, or a new beginning with you. And they're losing hope because you're so damn successful, Cap. <laughs> Capricorn, you're stable and secure, you know? They can't keep up with you. Eh? Maybe that's what's going on here. You're not feeling very secure and not very confident. King of Pentacles in the upright. They want to reconcile with you, possibly. Or it could be somebody from your past. I don't know. Um, it could be family. It could be children. Maybe they can't keep up with you. Maybe it's somebody that's going to offer you some parental, um, some child um, benefits or something. Child, child support. The truth is out about somebody's stability. They have to pay child support. And maybe they lied. You know, they lied about their income. Maybe they're making more than what they stated. Oh boy. So yeah, the king of wands in the upright. This is somebody that's a fights for the underdog. This is a protector and a defender. Okay, could be a lawyer. Um, <clears throat> somebody that's fearless, is bold, uh, is a leader, takes action. Wow, somebody's not happy about that. Three cups in reverse, okay? Not happy at all. So somebody looks like we were getting our Capricorn. I always do. It's, you know, I give the descriptions out, blah, 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 but then we bring it together. Um, yeah, I think somebody lied about their income here. It could be for children or about the past. It could be alimony for all we know. It could be taxation. <laughs> No, right. Somebody lied. They have to pay up. I'm making a small offer here. The truth is out. Mm -mm. They want a new beginning. King of Wands in the upright. Just sign a Capricorn. Thank you. There's a uh, counterparts here. Wow. So we have somebody standing in their in their. This could be a public defense. This could be a defender. So it could be a lawyer. Uh, standing up for this Queen of Wands. And, Really, the Queen of Wands, this energy, male or female, it doesn't matter whether you're you're Capricorn or not or Fire sign. It doesn't matter. It's just the energy. Um, this person doesn't need anybody really to stand up for them, right? Um, they're strong on their own. They're independent and they're sure. They know thyself, right? Very confident energy. They're a warrior. Both of these people are warriors. Could be two lawyers fighting on behalf of a child or children, but this is somebody that's very confident. Right? They're very sure. They'll tell you. You don't tell them. Okay. They're... Let's see where this goes. Yeah. Waiting for some results. Waiting for something to mature. If it's an investment. Um, so far, this person's only gotten one pentacle. Right? And they're looking at this bush going, yeah, you, I know there's more. I know there's more. They underestimated this person. Okay. Oh, yes. They're waiting for some results. So they've got some information uh, some evidence here. It looks like somebody is uh, relying on a hoe. I, I don't often use that um, description, but in this case, I think it does. Yeah, they underestimated this person. They're going to have to come and give a gift and or an offer here. <coughs> Excuse me. This is something tangible. This is something valuable. That's going to put bring you know get somebody past these 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 mountains, which suggests uh, struggles, and into this beautiful garden where they can start building upon this this gift right this is a, all aces are a gift from the divine by the way yeah they're gonna have to pay somebody was unstable or they're lost they lost their relationship they were non-committal uh lost a home business stability some sort of foundation the party's over yeah they're gonna have to pay okay they, there was a family here. It's come to an end, you know, and somebody's being tor tormented through this mental torment, I guess. And there's awareness of what's gone on here. Let's see. <clears throat> Pardon me for coughing. I have a condition called costochondritis and my rib cage squeezes my lungs sometimes and it's uncomfortable. So I apologize. There's been some head games here, five of wands in reverse, but you picked your, your battles very wisely, Capricorn. You didn't engage in, and you walked away. 
Um, there was competition here. A lot of game playing. It could be up to five people that were involved. Whether that's family, friends, I don't know. So they're losing hope here. Okay. Star in reverse. This is not what they asked for. I mean, the end result is going to be not so nice for this person. They're not happy. Okay. They, I don't know. Maybe you got sick over all of this, you know, the stress, the worry. It's, it's conflict, right? <clears throat> Maybe it made you sick and you've healed. Four swords in the upright, bottom of the deck. You've rested, you've healed. There was heartbreak. The four swords in the upright, it, it's weird how they split it up. This is three swords here. So there's obvious heartbreak. And there's the sword of truth here. So the truth is out. Somebody was sitting on the truth. They didn't come out with it. Maybe it's lawyers. Maybe one held back some information. Who knows, right? It was an injustice. It was poor judgment on somebody's um, part. They didn't want to take accountability, okay? Lack of acceptance, lack of awareness. They're getting some karma here, some bad karma. Oh, boy, yeah. This is the Hierophant reverse. Could have been something against the law. Unlawful, right? Uh, divorce. Maybe you didn't get what was your due in a divorce. I don't know. Let's see. Four swords in the upright. You're waiting here. You're waiting. You've been stressed out. for You You waited a long time and it took a lot of healing. Whatever this is, Capricorn. I'm very sorry you've gone through this. Now it looks like somebody's losing. They're going to lose their... They're going to have to pay it back or going to have to make good on this payment. Um, they're going to be possibly cow surfing. Loss of a home or stability, right? Yeah, they don't know what to do. Two of swords in the upright. They're sitting on a fence. They're very messily conflicted. Um, you possibly didn't know what was going on. You had no idea. Okay. You were about, about you know, waiting and, and healing and you had no idea that somebody was dipping in, ripping you off. Ten of Pentacles in reverse. You were losing stability, security, your family. You didn't know what to do. If that's you or if it's them, right? And yeah, these people... Whoever this is, this is just energy, male or female, didn't sh seem to give a shit, okay? This is um, an energy that's very superficial and selfish, and, and, and <sighs> they don't care who they hurt. They emotionally manipulate people. They use e emotional blackmail, and uh, their emotions are all over the place, okay? They don't care who they hurt. They're very superficial. Yeah, they use, use the courts possibly to their advantage, right? Yeah. So that's the way they were within a relationship with you. Take it as it applies, Capricorn. Let's bring this together, please, Spirit, for the Son of Capricorn, third week, third week of May, 2022. Why is the Ten of Pentacles in reverse? So somebody's losing their, their stability and security and or family. Okay? They're blocked from it now. And now that the truth is out. Oh, yes. Truth is out. Taking action. This is victory, success, a breakthrough. This is getting... Getting down to the heart of the matter here. This could be a, a new beginning for you because all aces are new beginnings, right? They're a gift from the divine. And somebody wants to put this behind them as soon as possible. If the courts were defrauded and in turn defrauded you, they're going to want to handle this quickly. This is uh, embarrassing. This is disgraceful. Yes, this is victory, success, okay? Recognition, reward. This is you sitting here. You went through so much, Capricorn. That's the Six of Wands, Ten of Wands. You had a lot of burdens on your shoulders, a lot of stress, <clears throat> a lot of worry. And they had so they had something to prove. They had a chip on their shoulder. They had a point to prove, right? But it's come to an end. It's the Ten of Wands. The cycle's ended here. Yeah, and that, that leaves them stuck, okay? That left them stuck. They don't know what to do. They're angry. Oh boy, vindictive, vile, uh, angry, uh, spiteful. They lied. Somebody friggin' lied, okay? Just to get even, just because they had a, a point to prove, you know. Get a, get a hobby, get a hobby, okay? This is all to, to bind you to something. This is evil. This is corrupt, okay? Devil energy, jealousy, greed, um, obsession, they wanted to block you. They wanted to stop you from moving on. Okay? Six of Swords in, rever in the reverse. Right? They're in hot water right now. Okay? This is trouble looming. Yep. Parting of ways here. They made... If it's not a recent parting, 
<clears throat> what this is, is poor judgment, okay? Very poor judgment. It's a card of consequence, whether it's in the upright or in the reverse. Whatever they've done here, they're in trouble, and they're going to get some consequences for what they've done. They're a fool, okay? They take a risk. They're a fool. Yep. Yep, they're out of money. They want to come back in from out of the cold, possibly, or they lost a great deal of money, or they will be. Five of Pentacles in reverse. I mean, they're out in the cold, not just financially, but spiritually, uh, socially, just morally out in the cold. They're feeling this coldness, okay? Heartbroken. Regretful, right? Wounded warrior. You went through a lot. They hurt uh, They hurt you so badly. This is emotional wounding here, okay? Persevering, overcoming. You don't trust this person. Look at the side eye. I don't trust you. You've hit me over the head nine times now. Not going to be a tenth, okay? I got you right by the balls. <laughs> Good for you, Capricorn. It's over. It's a profound and a very permanent ending to the situation. This is not going to come back up again, okay? It's not. This is going to change this person's life because you were dealing with a narcissist. If not a narcissist, it's a pathological liar, somebody that uses and abuses people in the cold, calculated, and cruel, possibly violent, dangerous, abusive, very abusive. Yeah. They're making a decision about this person as we speak, possibly. Making a head of a heart decision. Weighing their, their options here. Bringing back. They needed clarity. They could have been lacking clarity. But they have to keep things in alignment here. This is the universe, okay? The, the infinity symbol. I mean, the universe is involved here. They're bringing alignment into this situation, okay? They're bringing some clarity, some balance back. This is a big revelation. This is a big shock. The truth is out. The universe is coming in, shaking things up. Because it was a false sense of security. False impressions, right? Could be an eviction. It has something to do with a home. I don't know. But it's going to be a big shock here. The lid's blown wide off with this thing. Okay. Somebody's going to lose their position, possibly. Be replaced. Not a custom reverse. This is not wish fulfillment. Somebody was smug and full of themselves and selfish. Could have been some addictions going on here. Yep. Glutton. Glutton for punishment, I heard. It's not the first go around for this person. They've done shit like this before but there's no emotional fulfillment or happiness here no sense of satisfaction no no achievement personal achievement nothing right they've they've been defeated they're overwhelmed they have no defense for what they've done they've broken the law and or abused you they went over they went they were reckless didn't think very immature uh, energy um act now think later knee-jerk reactions, anger. Maybe they had anger issues as well. I mean, it wouldn't surprise me. They're, yeah, they're very, very in, in, insincere and immature. Yep. They might be having an emotional upburst at this moment. There's action being taken against them. Yeah, they are actually being taken against them, Capricorn. I'm going to leave it there. We, this is obviously going to go on and on. There's more to it than this, obviously, but hopefully we'll get it. We'll get to it uh, either during a, um, collective read or maybe next week but the arrow master hitting the mark intention and detachment so you're detaching from this whole scenario will fortune you had to go through this okay this is fate destiny to get you to where you need to be in life okay this is going to propel you hitting the mark okay this was the intention unfortunately as painful and as hard as it was it was intended to get you where you need to be on your path towards success towards stability towards happiness possible love right so let's get a closing card here spirit guides guardian angels ancestors of the white light how would you like to end this read for the sign of capricorn third week of may thank you not for you in reverse number six so six in reverse is obviously the lovers in reverse it's been a separation poor judgment where am i going there's consequences there's consequences this person's facing their consequences here they they played around they you know Played around with luck, played games here. Obviously, it's a chessboard. It's a, um, a fortune cookie here. <clears throat> They're being watched. Oh, yes, they are being watched. It's all a game. So, you know, game playing, it comes to an end. Eventually, you get caught. So, since in the reverse, Capricorn, I'm just going to read the protection message for you, all right? Don't chase after what flees from you. Don't obsess over what eludes you. Don't bang your head against the wall. There's nothing romantic about what is unavailable. No prize given for torturing yourself and nothing to be gained by refusing to see the red flags that have been waving since you began your pursuit. Now's the time to walk away. 
There are other goals, other loves, other games, other successes waiting for you. The way out of, the, of obsessing is radical acceptance and surrender. Spirit wants only the best for you. This is a sign that you have something much better waiting for you, so trust. You are right where you need to be right now, as, as uncomfortable as it is. You need to be here. It's just going to make bring you to where you need to be. So trust that. Trust that this is just temporary. You will get through whatever this is. And I wish you the best luck, okay? I wish you great healing. Capricorn, if you like the read, please like, share, and subscribe. And hit that notification bell. Remember that. And until next week, take care.